former President Donald Trump expressed his profound sympathies to the families of the three U.S. service members killed in an attack by Iran-backed militants on Sunday, blaming President Joe Biden for this terrible day. This brazen attack on the United States is yet another horrific and tragic consequence of Joe Biden's weakness and surrender. Trump, who is currently running for the GOP's presidential nomination to again challenge Biden, wrote in a series of truth social posts about the attack. He went on to tout his tough stance against Iran as president, saying that this attack would never have happened if he was still in the White House. This terrible day is yet more proof that we need an immediate return to peace through strength, so that there will be no more chaos, no more destruction, and no more loss of precious American lives. Our country cannot survive with Joe Biden as commander-in-chief, the former president wrote. In the wake of the attack, Republicans condemned Biden's perceived inaction so far, and some went further accusing the president of appeasing Iran. Trump echoed the remarks of other Republicans, saying the day was further proof a change needs to be made. 